Hey y'all, welcome to a snagbear.com tutorial. Now within this tutorial, I'm going to talk about geotags. Now, if you're not familiar with geotags, what they are, if you use a smartphone such as an Android or an iPhone or a lot of popular cameras nowadays, uh, there's settings that are often by default to include location data. So uh, someone that received the uh, photo that you shared they could find the geographical location where the uh, uh, where the photo was snapped. So there may be certain photos that are made where someone may not want to advertise the uh, the location where it was shot. So there's a really cool app if you're a Mac user, and it's called GeoTag, and you can just do a Google search and download GeoTag. So basically, all you do you take one of your photos that has uh, the geotags in it, you know, the location information, you drag it into the geotag app. And then here you can see the uh, longitudinal and latitudinal coordinates where this photo was taken. And this was taken, uh, it was taken offshore of Bermuda. And you can see right there on the map within the geotag app that it's there. So basically all you have to do is highlight this uh, particular photo and then do edit and delete. Now you can see the geotag information is no longer present within the uh, uh, within the photo. So then just simply save the photo and what you may want to do is reopen uh, reopen your geotag app and see if uh, see if the geotag information is is no longer there. So I'm going to quit geotag and then I'm going to relaunch geotag And I'm going to drag this same photo back into GeoTag. Now, as you can see, it doesn't populate with the uh, with the location information. So, just another quick tip: share this video with others. Uh, be sure to visit snagbear.com to enjoy all of our how-to videos, review videos, unboxing videos, and much more. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.